What colour dress should the mother of the bride wear? Because the mother of the bride is an integral part of the wedding party, she must dress the part. She should wear appropriate mother of the bride attire that will make her look and feel her absolute best. Mother of the bride attire etiquette is usually easy to follow as it doesn't have many hard and fast rules. However, because every wedding is different, deciding on a colour scheme can be difficult. Don't worry though, we got you. We've put together a colour palette guide that will make shopping for mother of the bride dresses a breeze. It also contains advice on the do's and don'ts of dress etiquette. What does the mother of the bride wear? The mother is encouraged to clothe herself in something that she and her daughter will love. This has paved the way for elegant evening gowns, cocktail dresses, dressy pantsuits, timeless maxi dresses and other classy options to make their appearance during the wedding as part of the mother of the bride's wardrobe. When evaluating several options, it's always a good idea to shop for dresses that flatter your figure. Ideally, the hues and silhouette of the mother of the bride dress should complement the formality of the event as well as the venue and wedding theme. Having said that, here are a few key considerations to think about when buying such a dress. Seasonality will dictate the style of the mother of the bride dress. The mother of the bride's dress should be elegant, understated and above all seasonally appropriate. Mother of the bride dresses for outdoor summer weddings should be lightweight and flowy. She should not be required to wear thick, lengthy and heavy skirts. On that same note, the mother of the bride should consider adding a wrap or shawl just in case it becomes chilly. The venue will influence what the mother of the bride wears. The wedding venue can help you decide on the dress for the wedding party. An elegant classic long dress is suited for formal and semi-formal occasions, while a casual flowy outfit made with a light fabric in shorter styles will fit laid-back celebrations. Bridesmaid dresses and the wedding colour scheme can influence what the mother of the bride wears. The mother of the bride can take inspiration from the wedding gown and bridesmaid costumes to stay on theme, especially if the bride wants her to match the bridal party. You can get a swatch of the fabric so you can have something for reference and a source of inspiration. If the bride hasn't mentioned any specific preferences, it's always a good idea to wear something that complements rather than overshadows the bridal party's colour palette. Who picks the mother of the bride dress? While the bride will most likely provide suggestions and opinions about what her mother should wear, the mum still gets the final say. Ideally, the mother of the bride dress should be comfortable and flattering. Get the bride's opinion on colour and style as well as what to avoid so you have all the information you need to make a successful dress purchase. If your daughter is insisting on a particular style and colour that you disagree with, talk to her about it. Make sure you offer alternatives so the bride doesn't have to spend too much time looking high and low for another mother of the bride dress. What colour does the mother of the bride wear? The mother of the bride can wear any colour she wants, but it's better to avoid certain colours such as white, ivory or champagne tones, as they're considered bridal colours and may take attention away from the bride. Here are some do's and don'ts to keep in mind when shopping for a dress. Do Wear muted colours. Neutral and pastel hues are more muted and come in a variety of styles, so they're a good choice. They can also be adorned with metallics and other embellishments to dress them up and make them look more special. Don't wear bold colours. Wearing colours like bright orange and red is considered excessively bold, flashy and attention-getting, so they're best avoided. However, if the wedding party is wearing bright hues, the mother of the bride can wear a more saturated colour. Do pick colours that look good on you. Pick colours that flatter your skin tone. If you aren't sure what skin tone you have, check the appearance of the veins on the inside of your forearm in natural light. If they appear blue or purple, you have a cool skin tone. And if they appear green or greenish-blue, 
you have a warm skin tone. Warm skin tone. You'll look great in red, coral, amber, yellow and orange if you have this skin tone. Warmer hues of cool colours such as olive and orchid, as well as neutrals like cappuccino, taupe and cream, will also suit you nicely. Cool skin tone. If you have this skin tone, emeralds, vivid blues, frosty lavender and ice blue shades will suit you best. Warmer colours like bright rose red and neutrals like navy and cold grey are also great options. Do use this colour palette for inspiration. Here is a colour palette that will help you choose the perfect mother of the bride dress. If the bridesmaids are wearing corals, reds and pinks, the mother of the bride can wear darker, earthier hues from the same family. Colours like mauve, raspberry, auburn and burgundy will work well in evening and winter weddings. If the wedding party is wearing purple, the mother of the bride can wear plum, eggplant or lavender to add grandeur and richness to the colour purple. Silver, navy and gold are also excellent options. If the bridal party is wearing blues and greens, the mother of the bride can wear eggplant, peacock wine, navy blue, sea foam, pale green, grey, gold, silver and other coordinating colours. If the wedding party is dressed in oranges and yellows, the mother of the bride can dress in greys, taupe, beige and other off-white tones to look and feel sophisticated. If you're wondering what is the most popular colour for mother of the bride, it's navy, followed by blush and shades of nudes. Do accessorise. Here are some stylish accessories that will elevate the appeal of your mother of the bride dress. Shawl. A stunning shawl or shrug will not only make a statement, but will also let you cover your arms on cooler evenings, all while making you look graceful and timeless. Gloves. For a practical, low-key yet exquisite style, choose gloves with the right length, material and colour based on your outfit, the season, venue and weather. Pearls. A pearl necklace exudes understated elegance and beauty. They make a statement without going overboard, allowing you to add a classic and iconic touch to your wedding ensemble. Hats and fascinators. It can complement and complete an ensemble and comes in a variety of hues and styles that you can use to match the wedding's colour scheme. If you're looking for a more fun accessory, opt for a fascinator. Traditionally, the mother of the bride didn't use this accessory, but it has since evolved as an acceptable accessory for the mother of the bride. Just choose a hairstyle that goes with your fascinator. This will ensure that your accessory will work for you and not against you. Does the mother of the bride dress need to match bridesmaid's dresses? No. The mother of the bride doesn't have to match the bridesmaids or the wedding party unless the couple wants a more cohesive look. If that's the case, a bridal salon consultant can help you select a dress colour that will complement the bridesmaids. The mother of the bride can also pick a colour of her preference. It's fine if she wants to wear something that doesn't match the bridesmaids' outfits or the wedding colour palette. Should mothers of the bride and groom match? Typically, the mother of the brides choose their dress first and then coordinate with the groom's mother. This helps them choose dresses that complement each other rather than clash together. Their dresses can be of any colour, style or length as long as they are appropriate for the wedding. However, if the bride and groom want their mothers to wear complementary colours, the mothers of the bride and groom should discuss ideas and collaborate on their outfits to prevent mishaps. The happy couple can offer suggestions for colours and styles, as well as the degree of formality to help speed up the process. Wedding party dresses can seem like a chore, but it doesn't have to be. Simply communicate with your daughter about what she wants you to wear, then add your own personal touches. You will still have a lot of say in terms of style, colour, length and accessories without deviating too much from the theme of the other wedding outfits. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy our videos, please like, comment and subscribe to our channel 
and hit the bell button to be notified of new videos. See you in the next one.